guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mariam. This is Lee, hey my guys. special guest for this video. No, this is not a relationship advice episode three. This is even better. Lee is going to be doing my makeup. Oh, he is very confident because very nervous are you kidding he thinks <laughs> he knows everything about makeup being that he's been in this industry for five years i'm a fan but i've never put makeup on somebody before like you're the first person i've ever going to be putting makeup on i'm going to be doing a tutorial i'm awesome. going to be doing an everyday go-to natural glam makeup look on maria <laughs> wow Damn, that's a long title. I'm laughing already, you guys. Yeah, so without further ado, you need to get some products, man. Okay. And you guys need to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already and hit that notification bell. Let's do this. I'm Come on. so scared. We're in Mary's room. Don't help me. There's uh, Ollie sleeping. So we didn't need setting powder, so I know Laura Mercier is good. And so we just have too much makeup, that's the problem. Oh man. I'm gonna go with this is so much. Let me see. Kind of colors I want to do. Mm. Ooh, too many colors. Maybe that's good for me. I think I'm gonna go with the star palette. All right, so I'm gonna use this. Those are primers. But it's a corrector too, right? So you got you got a little acne. Wow. Where is the foundation, Lee? Okay, my bad. Foundation, foundation, foundation. Damn. Concealer. Whereas, obviously, I know what this, drawer. I know what, this one. Yeah. Light, medium, and a medium. So we can mix those two together. So I'm looking for something that, like similar to your natural lip color. Charlotte Tilbury pillow talk. That's beautiful. Pillow talk. I'm going to do this Natasha Denona in uh, Brazil. It's a good choice. I really want to make sure everything is flawless. We're going to start off with Lancome uh, Ton Adol. And I like to work with cotton balls. Bear with me. We're going to conceal some of these. <laughs> Just not. Calm down, sweetheart. Calm down. <laughs> but I'm just doing moves. I always see like Instagrammers and makeup artists always rolling something. Always like, Who does that? Everybody. Like daddy. I've seen Mac do that. Before I put the foundation, I want to build. So I'm just going to. What is this? That's shape tape, son. Yeah. We're going to mix a little bit of the shape tapes. And what we're going to do now is basically apply ever so gently in those areas that we just corrected, but like working from the outside into the area that you put most of the correction on. Looks good in the monitor. Oh, I didn't notice that one. Okay, bear with me. Do you want a beauty blender? This is like the original beauty blender. It's like a bitty blender. Oh, okay, relax. Look up. There yeah, I'm just blending it out. We're all done there. Just gonna set the eye. Well, you can use everything with a Q-tip. <laughs> Q-tip king over here. I like it. It kind of like gives you the effect you need and then you don't have to even clean your brush afterwards. You can just throw it out. Next is going to be foundation time. So I'm going to be using Infallible by L'Oreal. Freshwear, the one that I love. Bam. So I'm going to use the dark and light to make an overall rounder looking appearance. You don't like my chiseledness? No, it's a, it's a look, but what we're going for is a different look today. Oh. What are you doing? I mean, I have to work. Why? Because I'm doing I'm doing things that make sense to me. All right, so let me see. You're probably 460 naturally, and you probably go darker with a 465. So I'm gonna go in there. What the? F so just dipping it into the jar here of mixed custom foundation. <laughs> So don't be afraid to get in the hair. It's actually a good thing. Make sure you get into the demarcation line. Okay, okay, okay. A little heavy handed there, buddy. Sorry. Mariam has some really good face. I mean, skin, face too. So I don't really need to go too hard. Let me see. Looks very good. I'm gonna take some of her natural shade. Now I'm gonna use the back of my hand. That's a lot of foundation. Shh. Why are you shushing me? It's my <laughs> channel! No, no. <laughs> yeah. I feel like you're kind of killing yeah. this. Thank you. I'm gonna seduce you right now. You're not seducing. <laughs> so there you go, skin's done. Oh, I gotta set it. Uh, that's a lot of powder. Yeah, but you, you have uh, oily skin, right? Yes. That's why. It's the blow for. Just I wanna protect you. <laughs> you really wanna concentrate in the T-zone area? Go ahead. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good. You uh, would never yeah, know that you were wearing makeup. I'm gonna contour real quick. But you just set my face. Hey, why are you stepping on me? So like after you set with powder, no yeah. creams go on. Like once you transition. That's not true. It's not true. Like you'll get a little bit more fall off from the cream, but the cream will merge with with the powder to create a more natural look. Don't listen to him. So what you want to do? What are you doing? Not that. <laughs> yeah, this is the truth. How the hell are you to, gonna blend it out? Easily. 
I'll show you. You will remove the makeup. No, no, you won't. Okay. So when you have cheeks already, obviously you would want to go this way, right? You can set it, come back, we'll set it again. If you don't have cheeks, do it before you set it. Gently come across and work like that. That's one line. And then gently over here. And that's it, really. That's all you need. Nice. What we're gonna do is <laughs> very nice pats, especially along the edge and working it in. What you're gonna see is a really natural contour. And then what happens is... I'm learning some new techniques from you. And what it really is, like you won't really see it too much, but it's there. You just wanna create the illusion of a shadow. So you wanna go high and then to a point, whatever that shape is. All right, so it's really light contour. I'm not, I would have liked to have gone a little aggressive, but you're being difficult, so I'm, gonna, <laughs> so I'm gonna move on. I'm gonna throw a little bit of highlight. What I chose was, I went with Fenty Beauty's Metal Moon. It's kind of like a clear. It's not Trophy Wife yellow. See, slight pop. Poppin'? I just finished the other side of your face. Yep. The highlight, again, I went with this Metal Moon because, you know, I was, I was, I really didn't want you to go like, oh my gosh, she has highlighter on. I really wanted to be like a glow from within. All right, so next I want to do is your lips, I think. Okay. Oh, I was going to contour your nose, but I'm going to keep it natural. Is that cool? Yeah. All right, I'm not going to do it. I was going to contour a line, put a little, mm -mm -mm. That's too much. Okay, for the lips, I went with Charlotte Tilbury uh, Lip Cheat, and it's called Pillow Talk. It's actually their most sold out. I didn't know that. Color. It's really pretty. Talk. All right, let me just take a moment. He's <laughs> <laughs> practicing on his hair. <laughs> Why is it nothing coming out? Do you need a pencil sharpener? Yes. <laughs> mm. All right, here we go. Can you lift up a little bit? Thank you. Here we go. Yeah, thank you. Are you giving me an Ellery Cupid's bow? No, I'm just emphasizing your natural. All right, we're almost done. Okay. Okay. And we're going to fill that in. Can you? Can you do it? You need some moisture. You need to moisturize your lips. Don't rub, just kind of. Yeah, that's good. I'm going, uh. How do you like that lip color? It's beautiful lip color. Though. Yeah, it's really pretty. Really pretty on you. Yeah, you did a good job, actually. I was going to leave your eyebrows alone. Honestly, I I'm happy with your brows. You yeah. don't think it needs a little some shom shom? I think a little tint would be nice. I don't. I didn't bring it. Do you any. want a benefit brow product? Yeah, do that. I just want to kind of just like brush it in with a little color. Boom. Precisely my brow pencil, ultra fine. Took a couple years to come up with a formula for this. Next, I'm gonna go in here, and Mariam already has some really great brows, so all I'm gonna do is just give it a little slay at the end. That's good. All right, next is your eyes. Let's jump right into it, it's my favorite part. I'm gonna be using Natasha Denona's Star Palette, and the reason why I decided to use this palette is because I really like the colors. Mm. I really felt the colors were leaning towards fall, but also had some springy action to it. So I'm gonna basically do a, a transitional eye look. I'm gonna take a fall color, but I'm gonna put like a spring vibe to it. So the, the hardest part was really about what color. I also brought like a clear glitter, that I want to put in just a slight. It's for an everyday natural go-to makeup. It's just makeup, yeah, but glam. glam. That's the glam. <clears throat> but that lip. Oh man, this is tough. I'll wait. I believe this is a blending brush. Nope. Put it down. That one and this one. I'm gonna go with this color here. It's called um, a tick. Is there like a technique to this? There is actually. There's a technique to everything. But apparently, you know all the techniques. <laughs> but now I didn't use a primer. Why not? because it's cold and we're not really in the warm season yet. So you won't be sweating or producing as much oils. Who told you that? It's just a matter of fact. I'm gonna just come in like this. And what I'm trying to do here is not mess up. That's pretty. All right, let me see. How many let me sees did you say in this video? <laughs> <laughs> is it easy to apply makeup to my eyes? I would not know. I've never done this before. It's actually very relaxing doing this. You should do this as like therapy. Mm, I need a little bit more color and I'm done. One way to know if you're balanced or not, just like put your finger on one end and the other and it should be a nice line. Done there. Then lastly, what I'm gonna do is apply the nice color. I should just tell you that with Natasha Denona shadows, these should probably be applied with a finger. I know. Why are you putting brown in the corner? It, your you your skin won't translate the brown as brown. It'll translate it and make its own color, which is complementary of the shadow choice I made today. And lastly, I'm just going to put a like a light color, and we're done. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh my! You're gonna see, and you're gonna be like, oh my god! <laughs> just like that, huh? It's so beautiful. Let's be very natural. You won't even notice it. Very, very, very nice. It's a real. Basic everyday go-to look. Is that okay? Yeah. 
I just feel like if I put glitter, because I have glitter in the inside corner here, I could double it up a little bit. This has really reflective crystals in it and reflect the light in a way that shows like, you know, hey, I'm being playful. <laughs> Lastly, I'm gonna be doing some eye lore, exaggerate. Oh, I didn't know they actually told you right and left. That's pretty cool. Hmm, why do you, I don't need to cut these. <laughs> I'm gonna go for it. Little lash glue. <laughs> Literally nothing. What are you doing? That's not gonna stick. Close your eyes. Are we gonna let the glue get tacky? Of course. <laughs> What's this nice little natural highlight you got here? It's called Nervous. Mm. Nervous by Lee World. What do you want me to do with my eyes? I want you to look a little down. I am so scared right now. That lash glue feels cold and wet. I could tell a good trick would probably be if the glue's a little wet, don't worry about it. Just keep on doing it and then just top it with some eyeshadow. <laughs> All right, open it up. <laughs> Voila. <laughs> okay. I would have liked to have gotten it in a corner. I didn't see that, but that's just a mistake because <laughs> I didn't have the right angle. I'll get it right this side. So what do you want me to do? Look Close down? Your, yeah, just like that. Perfect. Thank you so much. Yeah, that one came out real good. Yeah, that one's really good. <laughs> you might have got some glue in, that in the corner there. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello? Oh yeah, ma'am. It's Dan Carter calling for the National Hey, Police Dan. Department. How are you? How are you doing? Good. How's things? This lash, I gotta fix it. There you go. Let me see. Damn. <laughs> this lash came out bomb. This one? No bueno. Not bomb. Yeah, I'm gonna try to fix that with a little liner in the corner. Ooh, he's getting adventurous. Right there. Try that. Yeah, it looks better. I was supposed to put mascara on the uh, lashes before I put them on you, my bad. I think I'm done. Oh my. Oh head. my, okay. I see what you did here. What do you think? Mm. Well, outside of like the couple of foundation highlights, hot spots here and there, I think your foundation game is pretty good. The concealer, I think, is a little too light. I can especially tell in the monitor that there would be a flashback. Not at all. Where? Yeah, oh. right there, <laughs> sir. <laughs> I actually think the lips is my favorite part. Uh, kind of killed the lips. Yeah. You did good. The eyeshadow could use a lot more blending. I was going for that look though. Natural, everyday, go-to glam makeup look. How many of y'all would wear this everyday go-to natural glam makeup look every day to work? You could do it. Comment down below. Honestly, I ain't mad at you. Yeah. I think you did a pretty good job. <laughs> it's my first for time. For someone who's never done makeup before. <laughs> you were pretty cute. I enjoyed watching Actually, your facial expressions and I enjoyed this intimate moment that we had together being very close. You know what? I actually enjoyed it. I think it did pretty good. I would give you a six wow. on a scale of one to 10. I'm happy, I'll take a six. I think your foundation game is pretty good. I love foundation. Although I think That's my guys part. in general are pretty good at foundation. Did you see my brother doing my foundation? He was pretty yeah, he damn was pretty decent. Yeah, yeah. That said, you deserve an award for me. Yay! You make a dinner tonight? Nope. What are you doing? I need, I need, I need to be comfortable. <laughs> I keep on saying actually. That's how nervous I am. You're sweating, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually. So, so today I'm gonna be doing a makeup go-to <laughs> everyday natural makeup tutorial. <laughs> I'm finally here. I want to be here, but I'm here. <laughs> stop! Stop laughing. <laughs> Come on, stop I can't laughing. Your face. I'm trying to. Your face, I can't. I got this. <laughs> okay. You got it? Woo! <laughs> you ready? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Good. Can we stop? <laughs> I cannot. I cannot right now. And wait till you see <laughs> when I'm. <done. laughs> Almost barfed in your head. I'm I sorry. Know, I know. All I wanted was some love. Okay, I can't tell. I'm massaging your breasts. No, no, I don't need it. No, it's okay. Just like this. It's fine. You don't want to zoom into my look? <laughs> Do it! Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I need some wind. <laughs> what are you going to do for me? Sexy times. <laughs> Look at that natural blush. Thanks for watching. <laughs> <laughs> and for subscribing. for subscribing. If you want to watch me and Melissa Alatori put on makeup on Lee, then oh check it out over here. <laughs> Give us a thumbs up if you thought this was ridiculous. Bye. Peace out.